Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're on my channel, I'm Akanksha. So in this video, you've read the title already. We are going to do like a sale recommendation video. But basically, products I would recommend you buy, try products I absolutely um, love. Now ignore how I look or I sound, or if you see any nosy here and there because I have such such bad cold. But I really wanted to get this video into like you know on for you guys because Nike sale had already started. And if you wanted like you know recommendations, you can. But this video is a recommendation for any. Sales coming up, not just Nike. You can shop this in other sales also if you want. But the links I am going to use right now are from Nike's because Nike's sale is going on right now. I don't. This is not a sponsored video, but I do get commission if you use those those links. So you can choose to use those links or you can use um, something else. That's up to you. But. Uh, you know these are uh, the products i really like but i've also have done like recommendation of these things last year and before as well so i will leave those video links here too those are still my ride and die as well the products i'm going to mention now are the new ones so you can check out those and these as well and can you can pick the ones which you would like to try that being said let's get started So the first one uh, now I've been really into like you know getting my hair health right. So I have to talk about the hair oils I've been using. Oiling has been part of my um, you know livelihood. I think like all of us right Indian people have this oily thing. And my mom used to use like a lot of castor oil and all since I was a child. Hence I have really good hair I feel. But I don't know why like I just put oiling in the back seat for the previous year and I totally regret it. So I've been back to oiling my hair and two hair oils I absolutely love. Are uh, first is the Tribe Concepts 90 Day Miracle Oil. It's a you can see how much I used it. It's a beautiful, beautiful oil. It has a mix of sesame, bringraj, hibiscus, amla. It does not. It's not that one of those oil. It just has coconut oil and claims to be like a really nice oil. It's not that. It's kind of little lightweight, but that does so much to your hair. And whenever I use this, I love my scalp health. And I think this is one such oil I would always reach out for, especially because of the concoction, concoction of all the you know oils it has and all the ingredients it has so I really like this one I, I use it every time before like I wash my hair and then I wash it off and one more oil is this love beauty and planet onion black seed oil now this one is a new try but I've been using it for a while now and I actually really like it as well I love it for the application I love the ingredients of it as well it smells really nice uh, too which is an addition that one this one I don't know if you guys know how Polyhora smells this one smells like that but this one smells little more like jasmine and uh, um, stuff but yeah this also has really beautiful um, ingredients that we read it has sunflower uh, seed oil it has coconut oil it has almond oil it has black seed oil onion oil and pachauli oil really good all these ones really good for hair health so you can check these two out I use the combination of two because this has oils this doesn't um, so it kind of gives me like all the necessary ingredients okay my next recommendation would be candles because uh, i actually placed an order yesterday only bath and body works has buy to get to free so i've ordered like four candles which are, this is amazing uh, these three wick candles i love the three wick versions only other ones i don't really like because only the three wick i feel for the like the room capacity or like of the hall i have it kind of fills it properly with the aroma the one wick i feel like don't do much and then these are like 2700 each which is like damn expensive so i don't really buy them unless there's like an offer so at this point i just got buy to get to free and i thought it's an amazing offer i restocked on a couple of my fave and i ordered one which is really new i'm excited to try so you can try bath and body works i can give you recommendations a mahogany take wood absolute favorite of mine i think everybody will love this one i actually ordered a red one i'll put a picture right here i'm really interested curious to try that as well then i obviously uh, ordered the you know the vanilla one i'll put the picture as well so these are my really nice favorite ones so that, that those are what i've ordered then next one um you know this is a product i've spoken about before but i fell in re-fell in love with this uh product again is the simple face wash i think this face wash i wanted to give you like at least one in each category and for face wash i would absolutely recommend simple i think no matter which skin type you have you can really of like 
completely go with this one so i was actually using my dermat face wash before which is little you know on the stripping kind of side it had like a lot of acids it was also made with a lot of sulfate and stuff like that but it, i thought like you know for my oily skin i do need that and it was a very good one it kept my skin in check and all but it got over i never went back to him again to buy it and i had simple lying around and i know simple does do good for me so i used to only use it in the morning but but now i've been using it morning and night even after like you know cleansing like with a balm and an oil i use simple it still does not make me uh, break out usually i just feel like it's a little lighter for me especially when i'm removing my makeup but it's been doing absolutely great and that's the reason i can now actually confidently say i think no matter what skin type simple will be a beautiful uh, face wash especially because given it's winter it's a very gentle one fragrance free suits all the skin types so if you're looking for a good nice affordable face wash you can try this one it lasts a really long uh, time uh, too uh, my next recommendation is the l'oreal paris hyaluron uh, hair care range so they have a shampoo moisturizer and a hair uh, what do you say hydrating cream i really like all of them now obviously you don't have to buy all the three but all the three are really good so you can get the combo together or you can buy the shampoo individually or the conditioner i love the fragrance of it as well and i love what it does to my hair so i have a uh, naturally like wavy textured hair and i feel like it does a lot to control it and also it's that uh, uh, shampoo which is very hydrating i've noticed that when i use this my curls don't hold as much because it adds like a lot of nourishment to my hair which kind of makes it soft unlike some other shampoo which i use so if you if you have like oily scam scalp or like little oily dandruff kind of scalp probably you can avoid this but otherwise if you have normal normal scalp especially dry hair or dry scalp then you can definitely try this range i like the texture of it i like how it makes my hair uh, feel and uh, it does smell good as well so that is like an additional point then the next one i have is this carmacy uh, roll on deodorant and this is in the uh, fragrance floral sunset my favorite i cannot stop talking about this enough especially because it's just 249 and i feel like it does a really good job you just have to like open it and like you know put it wherever you want and it lasts for a good time and you smell so good so this is already you know really affordable but now it's already i think a 30 percent off so you get it i think for 160 or 170 so you can definitely try this one it's worth a shot you're not spending a lot of money and if you like it it's like you know a new item in your vanity which you always reach out for okay the next one is two-faced born this way concealer now um i've tried this concealer before as well like but i had a darker shade so i used to just use it to like color correct and stuff like that but i finally got a shade which i can like you know highlight my under eye or conceal and stuff and um, this was always a very hyped concealer right but i was like you know what is the hype and i tried it and i think it's a very decent one especially if you're looking for like a you know high end one which gives you full coverage but it's not like really matte or thick or heavy you can definitely go for um this one it it's, it has a lot of coverage but you feel like it's still not enough it's it, it it's a very nice balance i feel for this one and it's not drying whatsoever so especially under the eyes most of the concealers tend to be too matte and that's what kind of makes them look very unnatural but this does not do it but always obviously skin prep is a must but in a decent one in a high-end uh, version of concealers i have tried i think this is a really good one you can definitely try it out then the next one is i've spoken about a lot of matte products before you can check out the other videos but my love for this one remains constant this is the mac studio fix powder plus foundation this is i'm in the shade nc40 now this one i absolutely like because not just for powder sake but i love the fact that i can brighten up any corner of my face using this it just has that coverage to it but it's also not very heavy like like see i have a blemish right here right if i want to just cover it I can just tap on it and like do you see that see that's what i'm talking about i absolutely love this powder i especially like it to like you know brighten this under eye part after i've done concealer just to like highlight that part and everything and it does wonders so i am very very picky about my powders okay there are i think just a handful of ones i use and love on an everyday basis and this uh, does get into uh, the list then coming to lipsticks i think um, two really new launched lipsticks i absolutely love and i 
think everybody um, will love as well because the formulas are so beautiful and the colors are so stunning as well first one has to be the maybelline vinyl lipstick now that if you're somebody who likes shine in their lipstick then this one is for you because i'm a you guys know me i always wearing a gloss but then whenever you're wearing your gloss a lipstick longevity does like you know go off but this one like let me just i don't know why i started putting lipstick out of randomly my face entire is so blank now this is in the shade unrivaled one of my favorite shades like look at the shine in that lipstick i just applied it so i let let it leave, like you know be for like a minute and then i can show you like even if i rub it doesn't move and the shine does not go anywhere so this is one option i would say affordable amazing you can definitely uh, try it they have i think eight or nine shades and they all are uh, stunning you're but if you're not a shiny person you're a matte person and in the same range there are these plum matte lipsticks again this one also stunning the formula is really beautiful though it's matte it's not uh, drying and I like it I like the size of it I like the various colors it has like look at that shade this is in the shade cocoa mocha one of my favorite shades like when I apply it it looks so beautiful is that beautiful uh, brown and this is a matte one so like you know if you are a shiny person you can go for this this or you can just apply gloss on uh, this as well to make it shiny and I like them both and they look stunning coming to uh, skincare two products i've tried recently and i absolutely love are the uh, dot and key range like dot and key as a brand was always like made me you know curious to try them but i've tried few before and i was like mm, they're nice but absolutely like i fell in love uh, product kinds are these uh, two so the first one is the dot and key 10 percent vitamin uh, c plus e super serum and the um dot and key is vitamin c plus e moisturizer so these two i love so much so i started using the serum a month ago and i started using this moisturizer like 10 days ago now i obviously don't use them together i use them like separately you can i don't know if you can use them uh, together because on the this thing they don't mention the percentage of vitamin c i just don't want to overdo it so i use it separately this has 10% vitamin C plus niacinamide and I, I feel like it gives such good results for my skin so I had these couple of new breakouts which were so intense black and I think within 15 days like they diminished so much and I think it is because of um, the serum and I think it's really uh, nice and I think this is one of the ones which now makes me curious to try a lot more so I tried I now I recently started using the glycolic acid serum as well so like you know one hit product gives me like you know okay now I want to try more from the brand but yeah this is a recent vitamin C I've tried and absolutely love but obviously a uh, one which i've tried and tested for like over a year now is this only vitamin uh see this though i've seen amazing results it gives such hydration to the skin while you know brightening your skin as well again this also has niacinamide and uh, you know vitamin uh, c so like both of these are this is a new find this is an old find and uh, you can uh, shop whichever one that you think suits you i think both of them are amazing and both of them do the job really well and of course ole has one more now this one i felt for especially not for my experience but from my uh, mom's experience because i made my mom use this more than i did this is the retinol 24 night serum now retinol is something which is really good especially if you're looking for anti aging rejuvenation and stuff like that and this serum has done so 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 good like the results are so good for my mom like overall her skin has become a little more healthier she used to have like my mom has sinus okay so every time she gets cold like there was a phase where she just like became so dull like she had so many dark circles wrinkles because she was so sick and slowly she wanted to like you know get into good skincare and that's when i gave her this one and her skin had become so 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 good after she started using this and a couple of others and i think for your mom for yourself if you're over 25 you can really start trying this and i think it'll do really good for you now the next products i would suggest is for you to restock and stuff so yesterday when i placed order like i restocked on my body moisturizers razors like etc so i ordered the defending for her bombay shaving uh, wala razor because i really love that one especially because like when we shave usually the hair gets stuck in the razor right but for that one razor the hair te the technology is that that the hair doesn't get stuck in between the blades so you don't really have to constantly 
instantly like you know I wash it off or try to get it out so I've been using that for years and I really like it I always just get the uh, refill blades and yesterday I placed an order and they are on discount as well then uh, I uh, body lotion the Nika Wanderlust body lotion I placed an order it's a really good one and I also ordered Nivea body lotion so you can try those as well it's because somebody asked me to give a perfume recommendation but my favorite my most favorite perfume has to be this Versace Crystal Noir like no matter what the mode I feel this just brings me like into a good place I love the fragrance of this it just smells it's, it's 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 one which is suitable like no matter where you're going night day anywhere and I absolutely love this one you can see it's done a lot I've used a lot of bottles before this as well and I absolutely love this one so next the sunscreen recommendation from me would be the earth rhythm ultra defense spf 31 i've tried the 51 but the 31 is on another level and i absolutely love it so it is again a hybrid sunscreen it's not just a mineral sunscreen it does have chemical filters in it as well and i've always been a very like you know vocal about me just using mineral sunscreen because chemical filters doesn't suit me and wagera wagera but this particular sunscreen they have upgraded their chemical filters not just the traditional older ones like Avobenzone, Octolin which don't suit my skin so they have a newer technology and newer comp uh, you know co combination of chemical filters which are good enough for my sensitive skin as well this comes from Korean skincare a lot I've seen this in Korean skincare too they have up upgraded in like you know terms of these uh, sunscreen filters there and unlike the US etc so these ones really suit me so this one really suits me so even if you're just like a mineral only person you can try this one I think it'll suit you for my acne prone skin also it did really well and I love the way it looks after like for somebody who uses mineral sunscreen I always struggle with it being like too matte the sun you know finish is too like whitish and stuff like that this just get absorbed into the skin really well it gives you such beautiful glow and it does not make me break out so the sunscreen has been my right and I use it literally every single day and I really like it like it so I think you can definitely try that one if you're looking for a good nice sunscreen so that's about it you guys again all the products I've recommended before will be linked right here you can definitely check those videos out and see the other products those actually have more makeup recommendation this kind of become I feel like skincare body care plus makeup kind of thing so if you're interested in more makeup recommendations you can definitely check those uh, videos and because I don't have like a lot of new new favorites for uh, makeup so so I'm just do not concentrate much on it uh, but yeah I hope this helps again all the products will be linked in the description box if you want to check it out you can definitely use those links to purchase and that's about it I hope this video was useful this video shout out goes to Kartika D thank you Kartika for always loving and supporting it absolutely means the world to me if you want to be part of next video shout out then all you have to do is comment below and use the hashtag AKS and you can be a part that's about it for this video I'll see you guys in my next one Bye.